How can Montreal Council help a cultural organization like Agora Art Circle to support the well-being of its community and encourage people to creatively collaborate? Maria, thank you very much for raising this very important question. Arts are an important part of our community and indeed our economy. And so it's very important that we do what we can to support organizations and indeed artists to come through this pandemic with as little damage as possible. So we've done lots of things, and so I'll go through those one by one. Firstly, we are honoring our promises to organizations and artists. The promises we made were about fees and grants, so we are paying them now and without delay. Recognizing full well that they may not be able to produce the work, but of course, producing work doesn't happen overnight. Much thought will have gone into creating the product, and so we think it's right that the grants are paid and that work will, of course, remain there in the mine or there, and we will share it in time. Secondly, we have had to cancel the Ones of Arts Fringe, which is a great regret, and May would have seen a huge number of activities in the bar. But what we've done is we've paid all the money out to artists and organizations. The work we've commissioned has been paid for. But it's also given those who want to take up this opportunity an opportunity to put that work on digitally. So it can be streamed into your home directly. So hopefully many organizations will take advantage of that and, and their creative talents will, have been, will be shared by people of this borough. Added to that, the Nine Elms team is continuing to commission works which don't require people to breach the social distancing guidelines. So that's an important part of commissioning that we are continuing to do. We have set up a web page for organizations and artists so that they have information about all sorts of financial support that is available through central government, local governments, Arts Council UK, trusts and foundations. It's again very important that people are resourced not only now but in the future so that they can continue to contribute to the artistic endeavors of this borough. And finally, we continue to, to, to publicize whatever artistic and cultural activities are still continuing in the borough. And of course, there are virtual platforms for arts, artists, organizations and others to take part and continue to remain in link with each other. Hopefully, with all this help, our vibrant art scene will remain vibrant and come through minimally scathed after this crisis.